Well guys, we made it up to Shasta. Fishing the Phil's Prop Tournament, February 9th, 2020. Ready to get it going. Pushing 81 boats right now. Big turnout, so. Came straight from Clear Lake. You ready, Bo? I'm ready. We Wasn't made it. as cold it. as I thought, so. Oh, National Anthem. You gotta stand for that. You always gotta stand for that. Got done with the national anthem and <laughs> we're ready to go. Would you say and play ball? Yes, sir. Play ball. He said play ball. Play ball. Happy oh. to be here. Our first Phil's propeller tournament, and we're get, trying to get some good luck rubbed off of this boat. <laughs> They're on a streak. So, yeah, excited. Thank you. Man, it's good to see you guys out here. Wish you guys luck. We got some club members out here too. Ricky Hawkins. Good to see you out here, bro. Oh, thank you, man. She was a grind, nine fish all day. Yeah, buddy. Good at first. 
Like it just went boom. That's not what you want to see right there. Well, a little update for you guys. It's clear like all over again, just without the fours and five pounders. The battery's dead again, so we're kind of Kind of just out here in the middle of the lake, just kind of floating around, catching a few fish here and there when we can, but. But for now, we're just gonna keep on going until we get back to the ramp. You might catch a donkey, you just never know. You keep throwing this bass unit A rig around. We're gonna fish a lot of water we don't normally fish, so might come across a giant. I mean, just boom, knock slacking it, and then nothing. <laughs> Let's see that. Oh, yeah. That's, That's a good one. two and a half. Here comes the Calvary. And hopefully, is that them? I think it's them. Yes. Yes. The Calvary is here. <laughs> Rick's a gosh dang lifesaver. Thank you, Rick. <laughs> got this thing Anytime. hooked up. Oh, don't start right now. Oh, yeah. You got the motor up. Yeah, you got to sign my boat. <laughs> Take out his boat. Oh my god. So we're we got the battery hooked up. We're gonna see if this thing starts. Let it go for a little longer. We're gonna let it sit for a bit. 
We're so close to the marina right now. We almost made it. Boat started. We're going. But trolling motor, she's just she's she's all out of juice too. Had that thing on 10. We're going 0.4 miles an hour. There's yeah, we're gonna have to cut this thing an hour an hour early. Yesterday was a half hour early, today it's an hour early. So we're gonna go get our fish weighed and see how we do. You know, it's 144 right now. Our check-in was at 315. So might as well just get this over with. And uh, yeah, I need to invest in some new batteries. Any recommendations? Put a comment down below. <laughs> we, we trolled all the way from the mountain to the sack. And on the way there, he caught like a 230. Hold something. That probably doesn't help either. Have to pump turn. We're a disaster right now. Yeah. We're just a mess. Like yesterday. God, I wish. That's what we need. Pick one, Bo. And cold, and then we pulled out right after you guys. Big fish 240. Really? Shut out for us. I think 240. Yeah, yeah, it was. Well, they always weigh light. That's good, because it's a good surprise in the Yeah, it is. <laughs> oh, I had like 1055. We got a series of unfortunate events. The boats, batteries, not holding the charge. They're just, they're done for. Need to get some new ones. So, once we got to the dock, we just weighed our fish and we got everything loaded up. We went up top and we were gonna wait to see how everybody did, you know, the weigh-ins. So we had 10 and a half pounds. So, not the best, not the worst. And uh, so we're gonna, we were gonna stick around, but when we got up to the top, we saw our buddies Chang and Kay. Chang, unfortunately, he had a worse day than we did. He, uh, what do you do, Bo? Cracked his transom. So he has about a 16 inch crack running from the top of his boat all the way to the bottom. And it's split wide open. So we're following right now, going back to Warville. We're not too far behind him though. Just in case that mother trucker goes. We won't be in the sun, line of sight, line of, uh, line of fire. Line of fire. Well, we made it back, safe and sound. Followed Chang and Kay all the way home. And I gotta say, that was pretty, pretty gnarly. Someone was too busy sleeping the whole time. My neck's a little kinked right now. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, hey, I'm just like, hey, you, you all right? Yeah, I'm good, I'm good. I'm back out. So it's, it's nice to be able to pass out on the, as a passenger once in a while. But uh, now I made it back home and, you know, it was a good weekend overall. You know, just, it's one of those things like you gotta, preparation leads to success. And if we were well prepared before this weekend, had a good fresh battery, um, you know, 
is just you learn from it and you grow from it. So mm -hmm. you got the new Malonas, the Pro Am's coming up, club tournaments, and you got a lot of tournaments just one after another. So get this all situated, get this figured out so you can be on the water without having to worry about anything. And uh, shout out to everybody that's out there, supports us, you know, sees us as high, shouts out Bass Union, um, gives us jumps on the water. I mean, couldn't do this without everybody's support. So, you know, what'd you think about this weekend's experience, man? Uh, it, it was different. There was <laughs> a lot of high moments and then there was a lot of low moments. Yeah. A lot of laying on the front deck, just <laughs> waiting for someone to come. <laughs> come save us. <laughs> yeah. It was fun. Yeah. Had a good time. Yeah, cashing a check up on Clear Lake. I mean, ninth place against 159 other boats. It's definitely a cool experience. So, but uh, I'm not quite sure what, where you'll see us next. Hope you guys like the video. Subscribe if you're new to the channel. And? Like and subscribe. And? I don't know. See you guys in the next one. Oh, man. You're cool. Oh, 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 oh